below and happy Wednesday. Well, this is the day that I'm making this video, but it's probably not gonna be posted on Wednesday, let me tell you that. Today's video is about my favorite drinks from Starbucks that aren't on the menu. I work there and I have a lot of time to play around and experiment, so this is what I found. I thought it'd be fitting to wear my outfit. By the way, I'm wearing one of my pieces of clothing um, that I mentioned in my last video, so go check that out. Do it. The first drink is a white mocha vanilla bean frappuccino. This is literally like vanilla ice cream, but on steroids. So what you have to ask for, let's say you want a tall, which is the smallest size, you would ask for a vanilla bean frappuccino with two pumps of white mocha and then ask for sweet cream instead of milk. The sweet cream is already vanilla sweetened heavy cream and 2% milk. So you're gonna get like tons of vanilla and it's super duper sweet. But with the white chocolate, it's even sweeter. But together, it just makes magic. It's so good. And make sure you get whipped cream on top because that just adds even more fun. And if you want a larger size, you can just ask for one more pump of white mocha, depending on the size. The next drink is a pink drink, but sub in strawberry puree. Now... If you don't know that we have strawberry puree, it's what we use to make the strawberries and cream frappuccino. And if you sub the strawberry puree instead of the strawberry acé juice that goes into the pink drink, it is so good. It, I don't even know how to describe it. It's kind of like... Yeah, I don't know how to describe it. Um, I also, for this, I don't even, like, sweeten it, which is weird because I sweeten everything. But for this one, you really don't need it sweetened and it's refreshing and it's kind of healthy for you because it's literally coconut milk and strawberry puree, puree, crushed up strawberries. That's it. And whatever else is in that box. But ask for it to be blended. That's so important. It needs to be blended to be good because if it's not blended it's not gonna make any sense blend it up okay next um, a caramel cloud macchiato with sweet cream white mocha and blonde shots this is like diabetes central but so worth it so a caramel cloud macchiato is a it's kind of like a foamy like milk part and then the, your espresso shots are on the bottom and then there's like caramel that goes on top. Um, for this one, you would substitute the milk that's used for the cloud part, which is the, the foam. You would substitute the milk for sweet cream. Again, that vanilla sweet cream. With, and then you would do white mocha. I'm obsessed with white mocha, obviously. And blonde shots. Now the reason why I would use blonde shots is because they are sweeter. And, um, yeah, they're just like smoother and sweeter than regular shots. So it also just kind of goes along with the whole like sweetened macchiato. This is not something I get very often because it's very, very high in sugar but it's really tasty. <laughs> and the last drink is what I call a knockoff um, strawberry daiquiri. I love strawberry daiquiris. <laughs> Ask anyone I know, I get them all the time. When me and my friends go to like fancy restaurants in Scottsdale, I always ask for a version of strawberry daiquiri. And this tastes like it to me. It's, um, you get a blended strawberry lemonade 
ask for cream base i'll explain what that is in a minute and whipped cream and two pumps of vanilla if you're getting any size basically just ask for two pumps of vanilla the cream base is what we use to make frappuccinos and um The cream base is what we use for frappuccinos and that makes the texture really smooth when it's blended up. It's like a syrup. So that will help the flavor and the sweetener. Um, the whipped cream just adds to the effect like it's a strawberry daiquiri. And the strawberry lemonade, it like tastes like a strawberry daiquiri. I don't know if that's what's in a strawberry daiquiri, but it makes it taste like it. So. That's one of my favorites and that was one of my first discoveries it's an og i'm literally that person that will like if there's like nobody there i'm the first one to grab a cup and make myself a drink <laughs> that's okay though that's just me but every time like after a customer leaves and i don't have anyone for like two seconds i'll go back sip and then there's someone on like the drive through and then i have to go back that's that's me that's me running back and forth because that's what I look forward to at work. Those drinks. Get them. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And I hope you get those drinks a try. Let me know if you like them. Wish me good luck. I go to work today. So I hope you have a good day. I hope I have a good day. And that's it. That's it. Thanks for watching.